In the mid-1940s, Wing Chun master Ip Man, portrayed by Donnie Yen, and his family relocated to Hong Kong after escaping from Japanese-occupied Foshan. Ip had a dual purpose, to establish a school for spreading his martial art and to support his family in the challenging times of the era. However, attracting students proved to be a challenge due to his relative anonymity in the city. One day, a young man named Wang Liang, played by Huang Xiaoming, approached Ip, promptly challenging him to a fight. Ip easily defeated Wang, who left feeling humiliated but returned with friends to confront Ip. Ip prevailed in that encounter as well. Wang and his friends, deeply impressed by Ip's skills, became his first disciples, setting the stage for the growth of his school. Wang encountered trouble when he tried to promote the school by putting up posters. Hung Jie students took issue with this and challenged Wang to a fight, resulting in his victory. However, they retaliated by taking Wang hostage and demanding a ransom from Ip. The situation escalated into a confrontation at a local market, but they were rescued by Jin Shanjiao, a martial artist and former bandit, along with his gang. The conflict caught the attention of Hung Chun Nam, Sammo Hung, the head of a coalition of Hong Kong martial arts clubs. IP introduced himself, and Hung explained that before establishing his school, IP needed to undergo a special fighting ceremony to prove his worth. Following their arrests for disturbing the peace, IP, Wang, and Jean were released on bail. It was revealed that Hung and Officer Fatso were involved in a corrupt protection racket that extorted money from martial arts schools. Hung informed IP that to open his school, he had to attend a ceremony with all the martial arts masters in Hong Kong and defeat them. IP participated in the ceremony, besting several challengers and achieving a draw with Hung in the final match. Although allowed to continue running his school by paying protection fees, IP refused this condition. Consequently, Hung students began to harass anyone interested in Wing Chun, leading to a street brawl between them and IP's disciples. To avoid further trouble, IP relocated his school closer to his home. A confrontation between IP and Hung followed, with Hung blaming IP for not paying protection fees and IP criticizing Hung's management of his students. During their encounter, IP prevented Hung from accidentally kicking his own son, earning Hung's respect. IP departed, and the next day, Hung extended an invitation to a British boxing match he had helped organize, signaling a quiet reconciliation between them. The boxing competition serves as a platform for various martial arts schools to showcase their skills and promote Chinese culture. However, the event takes a chaotic turn when Taylor, the twister, Miller, played by Darren Chalavi, a star boxer known for his arrogance, racism, and brutality, openly insults and attacks students. This provokes the masters to intervene and restore order. Hung, one of the martial arts masters, steps up to confront Twister and defend his culture. Initially, Hung gains the upper hand due to his wider skill set, but in the second round, a devastating blow disorients him. His asthma further weakens him as he refuses to concede, determined to uphold his honor. Tragically, Twister beats Hung to death, causing outrage among the Chinese community. The news of Hung's death spreads rapidly, creating a scandal. Wallace, the event organizer, holds a press conference, falsely claiming that Hung's death was accidental and labeling him as weak. Twister, seeking to clear his name, challenges any Chinese boxer to a fair match, but he also boasts of his prowess. Ip Man, who has arrived to confront Twister, begins his fight as his wife goes into labor. Initially, he appears overwhelmed by Twister's sheer physical strength, but makes a comeback using his diverse techniques and speed. Twister delivers an illegal punch after the second round, and the rules change to disallow kicks. Inspired by Hung's patriotism, Ip Man adapts his strategy, focusing on disabling Twister's arms. The fight reaches a climactic conclusion as Ip Man delivers a series of blows to Twister's face, with flashbacks of Twister's killing of Master Hung. The Chinese audience celebrates IP Man's victory, while Wallace is arrested for corruption, thanks to a secret report by Fatso. Ip Man delivers a unifying speech, emphasizing respect among people regardless of their race or culture. Both Western and Chinese audiences give him a standing ovation, while Twister's manager leaves in disappointment. Returning home, Ip Man reunites with his family, including his newborn second son, IP Ching. In the final scene, a young Bruce Lee expresses his desire to learn Wing Chun from IP Man Ip Man smiles and encourages the boy to return when he's older.